What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we have a 2000 Ford Excursion. Going to be a 7.3 liter power stroke. It's going to be white with a tan bottom. Truck's in great shape overall. It's got really nice miles on it. It's been well taken care of. One thing I will note, um, the top layer of the hood insulation has fell. It's got a set of Pathfinder all-terrains on it in a 265-7516 with tons of tread on them. Frames in great shape overall. Got the factory wheels on it that are in really nice shape. Cab length running boards. It's got a matching set, treads nice. See the fender well, it's in good shape. The Limited. So it's got really nice options on it. Take you through those here in a second. See underneath, it's in good shape. Got a new set of shocks on it. What I love about the excursions, it's got the overhead and then it's got the barn doors down low. So you are able to close those and leave the top open for hauling stuff. It's got the spare tire, carpet's in good shape. Um, it's been extracted and vacuumed out. It looks really nice. Got the uh, folding seats, fold down and come out. Jump to the interior here. So white over the darker tan, tan leather interior. Bench second row. Bench is in good shape. Cup holders in good shape. It's got carpet factory mats. You can see in the third row. It's in nice shape as well. Um, these excursions have lots of knobs and buttons. Um, they all kind of do something different. You can pull this, flips forward, this will flip down. You can pull this for access to the rear. All sorts of different configurations on how you want to run this second row and third row. Up front, power window, power lock truck. Got the tow mirrors, got the heated passenger. Heated passenger seat. Front seats are in good shape. Foam's good and solid. It does have some stretch marks, but no rips, no tears. Um, just have the uh, limited embroidered in. Floor mats up front or factory carpet. Carpet are nice and nice shape. Check out the driver's side here. All the HVAC and infotainment knobs are nice still. Electronic shift four wheel drive. Got the overhead display. It's got the rear um, HVAC system with the window vents. It's got the double, double section up here for uh, sunglasses. Consoles in nice shape. Not beat up or anything like that. Check it out. This truck has 148,118 original miles. Go ahead and start it. That fires right up. You can see all the lights go out. Stock exhaust, so it's not overly loud.
So once again, that is going to be 148,118 original miles. A couple of things on the interior does have um, this overhead display and I'll show you the rear driver's seat. It's in good shape, got stretch marks, foam's nice and solid. This butt down here has got more stretch marks and it has a little bit of rub right here. Foam's super solid on it though, no issues. Power, heated, carpet's in good shape is on the side as well. Um, steering wheel, buttons. Buttons are in good shape. Wheel itself's in fine shape. Um, the material isn't torn through in any place, just rubbed, rubbed the color off up here and it's a little lumpy throughout this top half. Drivers is going to have power mirrors, power windows, window locks, power locks. And you can see they pick their feet up when they got into it. It's not all scuffed up. A couple things to note on the exterior. It's got um, a few little scratches here and there. Here's one of them, just a little tiny scratch. These trucks are really big. It's hard to get them all in the shot at once. Um, on the hood, hood's in really nice shape overall. No real rock chips stand out to me. There is a scratch right there. It's fairly faint. There's one right there and one right there. You can kind of see them. It's kind of hard on this white with the white walls. There you go. Um, I did note the chrome on the grill has been rubbed through right here. Through here, it's kind of looks like maybe it had a bug guard on it at one point and it had rubbed a little bit. It's got a little Audi dent right there. Um, headlights are in great shape. And then I did note there's a dent in the chrome bumper. Oh, I'd say it looks like maybe like a baseball hit it or something like that. Kind of give you perspective there. Up underneath, it's in really nice shape. So if you are interested in this truck or any other trucks you may see in this channel, feel free to reach out to us at 417-720-4995 or check us out on any social media at Enterprise Motorsports.